this morning still seeing a little bit of fog to kick off our day. That is what we expect here in the Bay Area, so nothing too crazy for our Sunday morning. But by the afternoon, I would like to say it's going to be a Sunday fun day because it's going to be gorgeous outside. These clouds are going to lift a little bit by this afternoon and we're going to be seeing plenty of sunshine. But the cloud layer and that cloud deck offshore has remained very thick and very steady all morning long. It is going to allow us to kind of cool down this afternoon though because yesterday the heat it was on temperatures went to 101 degrees in Livermore this afternoon about eight degrees cooler still in the 90s but cooler than the triple digits Concord 99 degrees yesterday expected to be in around 89 degrees today so cooler weather is on the way especially for our more inland areas San Francisco San Jose might see a temperature or two cooler than yesterday this morning though the winds are nice and calm and they are going to pick up this afternoon a little bit of an onshore flow will develop anywhere from 15 to 25 miles an hour but again that's what we expect for this time of year. That onshore flow is really great. I have read for surfing, so might be seeing some good surfing conditions later today with a lot more comfortable temperatures for our inland areas, especially again, no longer seeing the triple digits all across the valleys. We're going to be in the mid to upper 90s. So yes, it's hot. Yes, you still need to practice heat safety, but it's not for that heat advisory, it's not going to be nearly as aggressive and not necessarily that higher chance for heat illness, especially closer to the coast, 61 degrees in Pacifica, getting into the upper 70s to 80s further north. So again, it all depends where you are, but today we're looking at a bit more of that onshore flow and that's going to crack the heat this afternoon. The reason that will be about anywhere from a couple of degrees cooler to upwards of 10. By the time that we step out early this upcoming week, not much is going to change. That onshore flow will continue and very similar weather conditions are expected today, tomorrow, and over the next couple of days. But over the next six to 10 days later this work week and into the upcoming weekend, slightly above average temperatures are expected. So summer likely going to be in full swing by the end of the work week. But again, it's really not going to change all too much over the next couple of days. We'll remain in the 60s all across San Francisco, low 70s down near Oakland. And again, if you do live closer to the North Bay area, San Jose, it is going to be a bit warmer, very moderate into early next week, though. It's the inland East Bay areas that are still going to be hot this afternoon. Low 90s compared to triple digits, though. We'll take it. We will take more comfortable conditions that are going to stick around through the middle parts of next week before those temperatures rise once again. All things to consider, but overall it's kind of a boring weather pattern. As I like to say, my job is pretty easy over the next couple of days because nothing's really changing. We'll be seeing similar temperatures, that regular marine layer coming on shore. It's kind of what we expect for June this time of year. Makes perfect sense. And yeah. just looking at that seven day, I feel like you've delivered pretty well so far in your couple of days here in the Bay Area. I'm trying so. my hardest. <laughs> All right, Zoe, thank you.